We thank God for another victorious day. I'm talking to the team, the secret of long life with happiness. In Psalm 91 verse 16, the Bible says, With a long life, I will satisfy him and let him see my salvation. This is the word of God. Generally, sometimes, the greater desire of humanity is to live a longer life with happiness. Remember, longevity of life flows from God's grace. God is so merciful, compassionate, and faithful. And so to live a longer life, we must identify ourselves with this amazing grace through Christ our Lord. As a result, the Spirit of God will guide us to do what really God wants us to do, that is pursuing God's will in our lives. He will therefore give us the meaning of our lives and the reason of our existence. That is why he here for and what God really wants us to do. In the book of Acts chapter 9 verse 36 to 42. Now I read, A woman who was a follower lived in the city of Joppa. Her name was Tabitha or Dorcas. She did many good things and many acts of kindness. One day she became sick and died. After they had washed her body and they laid her in a room on the second floor. The city of Lydia was near Joppa. The followers heard that Peter was at leader and sent two men to ask him to come at once. Peter went back with them. When he came, they took him to the room. All the women whose husband had died were standing around crying. They were showing the clothes Dockers had made while she was with them. Peter made them all leave the room. Then he got down on his knees and prayed. He turned to her body and said, Tabitha, get up. She opened her eyes and looked at Peter and sat up. He took her by the hand and lifted her up. Praise God. Hallelujah. Dockers in her era find it to be so amazing to operate in alignment with God's word. This lady was selfless, loving, caring for those who did not have the den. She was a generous person who sought for others and supported the needy in the community. Dockers at that period left a legacy and transformed many lives, enlightening the burden of the poor. Her death generated a great interest and in other followers of Christ called for Peter. She was prayed for and then she was resurrected by God. Praise God. And so, an act of sharing Jesus with respect to our world, our time, His word can have a greater influence of living longer by His grace. And so, let's do share with others to God's glory. At a parallel level, the Bible says, we are what we eat, and so our diet must be taken into consideration, particularly when you growing up we should try to avoid fatty food to make our system medically fit. Equally important, physical exercise profit a little. And so we must exercise our body to make our body physically fit for the tasks ahead of us as we pursue Godly life in Christ. Last but not least, we should celebrate Christ through the joy of salvation with music, with music through praises and worship to God. Every friends, as we care for the needy, do exercise, manage our diet, celebrate Christ with true hearts, we experience true happiness and the outcome is the outflow of the joy of the Lord. Note this, happiness may lead to healthier lifestyle, have the tendency of reducing high blood pressure and stroke and other heart-related diseases. Bible friends, God bless you for enjoying this message. Share with others and subscribe to the channel. God bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen.